everybody, good morning. It's me, Lisa, with a special Valentine's Day episode of Lisa's Lowdown on Love. I got my heart-shaped hair blockers on, my love cup, my love shirt. I'm just full of love today. So I come with several messages. First, my single people out there. Listen, let me tell you a little story. Last year, exactly one year ago, I was single on Valentine's Day. Yep, that's right, I was healing from my divorce and a subsequent relationship with a psychopath that really banged me up. So I decided to love up on me on Valentine's Day last year, but there was something up with my energy. I had to handle it. I was even invited to an I hate Valentine's Day party last year, and I went to it. So from a law of attraction standpoint, this was no good. I'm a loving girl, I got love to give, I'm a sweet, divine, special soul. Why bang the drum of hating on Valentine's Day? Instead, bang the drum of self-love. If you're single, you gotta be loving up on you. So here's what I su suggest you do. Behind me is a flower shop, find a flower shop. And if you can't find a flower shop, go to the deli, go to a little local joint, maybe even your supermarket, buy yourself some pretty flowers, make yourself a nice little chocolate heap of love on a plate and indulge. Go get a manicure, go get a pedicure, go get a massage. If you're a guy, you don't even give a crap about Valentine's Day. For you, it's just another day. But, you know, do something nice for yourself too. So that's my message for the single people. Now, as far as my couple up people, I don't wanna hear this crap about every day is Valentine's Day, so I don't have to do shit. Wrong, wrong, that's a trap. That's a bullshit trap. Stop being lazy, go out right now, get a card, make one yourself, be creative, have some fun with it, because understand this, when you stop paying attention to the little things, the little days, the special fun little traditions, that is when you start to run into trouble. Now, if you notice, South Beach is really loud. It's getting louder and louder, and I don't understand why, and it drives me insane. Trucks, constant construction, sirens, always a state of emergency. I ask, with love in my heart, to my officials, my government officials, local government, to shut up everything. It's too loud on South Beach. So, let's recap. Number one, if you're single, you are going to find some roses for yourself. You're gonna do something that makes you feel good. It's very important. And if you're in a couple, don't be lazy. Go out there. You don't have to do anything super extravagant. But my God, you can at least get a card for the person that you love so much. And as far as Miami Beach, too loud not good for the soul too much clutter quiet it down love and light everybody have a great valentine's day bye